Mr. President, the Senate will soon vote on President Biden's nomination of my neighbor and fellow Oregonian Jennifer Sung to serve on the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Ninth Circuit. I guess I ought to save everybody some suspense. I am proud to support her nomination, and I just want to take a few minutes to talk about why she deserves the support of all senators. First, with respect to her qualifications, Ms. Sung is a graduate of Oberlin College and Yale Law School. As a student, she volunteered to represent low-income patients at a local hospital. As a legal fellow at the Brennan Center for Justice, she fought on behalf of workers who toiled in poor conditions for little pay. In private practice, she defended the rights of all people in our country to work in safe and fair conditions to get the health care they need and to freely exercise their constitutional rights. Currently, Ms. Sung serves as a member of Oregon's Employment Relations Board. That's the board that adjudicates disputes over labor practices and employment law. She has decided more than 200 cases in that role. She has proven, Mr. President, her impartiality, which I think we all understand is fundamental to what we need in a justice. And she's certainly shown her diligence and her commitment to justice. Her question, her, her qualifications, in my view, simply cannot be questioned. Second, I've had the chance to get to know Ms. Sung personally since her nomination. And what struck me, Mr. President, is we both have a family story that's only possible here in our great country. Members of her family fled political persecution and violence in China in the 1940s. The Widens fled the terror of Nazis just a few years earlier, and they barely spoke any English when they arrived here in their new home. Our country provided safety and opportunity for my family and for Ms. Sung's family. And I've always found, Mr. President, that so many who have that family story take a special interest in protecting the rights and the freedoms Americans enjoy. That's been a hallmark of Ms. Sung's legal career, and it's something, in my view, that all senators ought to support. So, Mr. President, I am proud to describe my Southeast Portland neighbor, Jennifer Sung, as a talented, committed individual who will be a great asset on the bench. She is going to be a superb judge. I urge all my colleagues to support Jennifer Sung when we vote soon on President, no President Biden's nomination of Oregonian Jennifer Sun to serve on the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Ninth Circuit. Mr. President, I yield the floor. And I would uh, note the absence of a quorum.